All right, now we're doing free code camp, new responsive web design. Learn more about CSS pseudo selectors by building a balance sheet. Step one. So now we're going to set up our HTML with the doc type HTML indicating this document is in English, head, and body elements. All right, we're going to give the head element an appropriate meta elements, the appropriate meta elements for the char set and viewport, and a title element with an appropriate title and also a link element for our style sheet. Okay, so we're gonna go until we forget how we did it. All right, so let's start off with that uh, exclamation point, doc type, HTML, like that. And then we're gonna have the HTML tag, HTML, and close HTML, like that. And we're gonna have inside of here, lang equals oops lang equals n all right so now we're going to go to the head we're going to make a head and a body all right so we're going to say uh, head and then close head and then we're going to do body and close body all right and inside the head element, we're gonna give the meta elements for char set and viewport. So we'll do meta. And inside here, we'll say char set equals uh, UTF eight. All right. And then we're gonna do another meta. So we'll say meta and uh, we'll do the, we'll finish that one up in a little bit. <laughs> Uh, and then we're going to have a title element in the head. Mm, give the head, chart set, viewport, and a title element. Okay, cool. We'll put it in here. We'll say title, and then close title, like that. And then the title will just make it balance sheet, like that. Uh, and then the link element for the style sheet. I forgot how to do that, too. All right, so now we're going to take a trip over to something, the, the quiz uh, the quiz project, because I forgot how to do all this stuff. So let's come over here to a new responsive web design main page. Uh, come all the way down here to building a quiz. Uh, let's open up 68 right here. And we're already on the HTML, so we'll come up here. So the viewport... Here's how we do the viewport. Let's just take this. All right. We know where to get it next time. Uh, so let's get rid of this one and drop this in it like that. Yeah. All right. And then let's come over here. What else do we need? Uh, the link for the style sheet. Link for the style sheet. Right here. Link rel style sheet href styles.css. Let's take this and drop it right after this. All right, and let's see, titles are probably title link, blah, blah, blah. All right, let's check it. All right, looks good, awesome, and submit it. All right, now we're on to step two, and we'll see you next time.